Hey guys, so in the book of Lamentations, it says, uh, for God's great love for us, that his compassions, right, his compassions are, are renewed and that they're new for us every morning. And I've been thinking about this and I'm like, man, sometimes you don't feel that love, you don't feel that compassion. And I had to think about it. I was like, uh, you know, maybe it's because we don't look for it. Look, um, this is going to sound crazy. Uh, so tonight we had a, um, we're potty, potty training my daughter. And, um, you know, for, for some reason, not just potty training, but just in anything, she's irritable. Uh, my wife spent about 10 minutes trying to get her to pick up um, little paint things from Lowe's that um, I picked up because we're going to paint our future baby's uh, room. And, uh, yeah, she ripped them up and put them on the ground and we're like you got to clean it up and she had a meltdown for 15 minutes and then finally I said no you're going to bed and I took her up to her bedroom and she is like just losing her mind as I turned the light out I put on her nightlight I'm not I'm not a cruel dad um but I put on her nightlight and was shut the door and was like no like if you can't be nice you're not gonna you're not gonna be uh, you know with, with the rest of us and, you know, like she cried. And then I went back in and I said, you sit on your bed and you calm down and you can come out. She sat and she calmed down. And it's like, man, it was just so frustrating because you're looking and you're like, man, this this little girl knows the right things to do and she's stubborn. And, you know, like I know one day, one day, one day, I'm going to love that stubbornness. But... You know, like right now, it's a challenge, and I have to sit and I have to think, like, man, you know, like, I have to think all of this trouble and all of this heartache, all these problems that, you know, like we're going through now, they're all going to be worth it, right? And that there's going to be a point whenever this happens, but how do you get through it now? It says that his, you know, compassions are there, that these things are renewed every day which means that if I start looking for it, that I can start finding it. And I just had to, I just laughed just like two minutes ago, right before I started this video, because I walked out of my room and was scared. Like, uh, just like, oh, because I looked down the hall and I'll show you, that's her baby doll. <laughs> and like my brain, I just walk, oh, you know, like there's, <laughs> and so I started laughing because I see this baby doll and I'm like, Oh, and I sit down and I read, I'm reading and I get to that verse in Lamentations and I'm like, Oh, like even in all this, there's good. And I mean, the night wasn't like we, we got her back to where she needed to be and she was happy whenever she went to bed. But it, I mean, in the trouble, in the, in the times that, you know, like things are rough, look for your creepy baby doll down the hallway that's going to make you smile. Look for what God has put in your way because there is something there because he knew that you were going to need something good in your field of vision. Thanks for taking a minute.